helps if you uh, helps if you open the shutter. Since when? Since always. Matt says you you clam up on the vlog. Rockwell told me that he was going to act like Burger and just say nothing or like one word answers. Oh. Have a good weekend, sir. Wu Tang Clan. <laughs> Do you have any advice you want to pass on to the people of the internet? Uh, just look both ways before crossing the street. That's a good, that's a solid advice right there. Right. Look tip both your, ways before crossing streams. And tip your bartenders and your waitresses. Where are you playing this weekend? Anywhere? Um, What's your next gig? Showcase Live, Madison Square Garden. Wow, you're getting out there, man. Up and coming. Good for you. Go rock the world. <laughs> so I'm back home in the sanctuary. I worked the day job, had a nice day, got a bunch of stuff done. All right, I'm lying to you. Today, I've been grumpy. I woke up grumpy. Well, I, I should rewind. I went to bed grumpy. Sarah and I had a disagreement. I went to bed grumpy, which is against our rules. So I seized all night. Woke up grumpy. Had to go to work. Didn't really resolve things with Sarah before I left, so that stayed with me. Then everything, well, not everything, but there was a bunch of stuff that happened today at work that was annoying. Um, but. What I'm saying is when I'm already in a bad mood, all that stuff is so much more worse than it is. Even when all of it, when pulled apart yeah. and separated, none of them are really that big a deal. It's just because I'm already in a bad mood, they're compounding and it's not doing much to improve me. So I don't work well when I'm like this. I feel like my designs suffer, my art suffers, and everything I create suffers. So I imagine this vlog is gonna suffer slightly because I'm not in a good mood and I need to change it. It would probably start by having a conversation with my wife, which we are doing tonight. First things first. And even the things that we're disagreeing about is the dumbest. It's just very minutia. It's everyday nonsense. But because we're not in sync, it's upsetting things. I need to be in sync with my wife. She's my partner. She's my, she's my number two. You know what I mean? She's she's my not sidekick because we're we're equals. But when things are out of sync with her, things are out of sync with everything else. And and that to me is the most important thing. She's the most important thing in this entire world to me. I love my wife. I love Sarah. I can't picture myself without her. And it's absolutely frustrating when we're not at the 100% that we normally are. And I'm not saying that we can't get back there. We're gonna get back there tonight. It just, it takes a little bit of concentration and work, which we haven't given it yet. So I'm gonna do my best. I'm gonna do my best to start here, start in this brain and get it resolved, resolve things with my family, and then hopefully resolve things with my art. But that's where I am. And if I'm going to be vlogging, I might as well be 100% honest. Because it does me no good not being 100% honest. This is real life. This is the real life of a creator. I don't know. I feel like this is the part that people don't normally like to talk about. They like to show them that, they like to show an audience that they're constantly having great ideas. And they're constantly creating and, and everything is just hunky-dory all the time. But it's not. I mean, that's life, right? Nothing is 100% perfect all the time. And right now I'm not perfect. Now it could be that I'm, I'm letting the stress of, of five weeks to the con kind of build on my shoulders and we're kind of doing some other things, so that's stressful. But they're excuses. I hate excuses. Everybody has excuses and no one gives a shit about them. In the end, it's only your actions that people can truly judge and I don't know. I need to improve my actions is really what I'm trying to get at. So I'm going to take some time this afternoon before Sarah gets home to kind of center myself. I don't meditate because I tend to fall asleep when I try to clear my brain, but I am going to sit and focus my thoughts and try to relax and improve the abysmal mood that I'm in. But it'll be good good news things that are positive I have to download one page 
page and then we could send stitches off to the printer. I talked to the people that were printing the comics. We're working with a company called Ready Comics out of Arizona. So I talked to Seth over at, Arizona, uh, over at Ready Comics today. They have the mundane men pages and they're looking good and getting ready to go. So I just have to keep an eye out to approve those. And everything's on track. But I think tonight we are going to see our friend Tolly's band or him. I'm not really sure. We were talking to him last week and I wasn't sure if it was going to be just him or him and a band. Anyway, he's going to be performing. He's performing maybe five minutes from the house, so we really don't have an excuse. We're going to go hang out and check his music out tonight, so that should be fun. I'll take you guys with me. And I don't know. Hopefully we're going to have a better afternoon than we did a morning. See? See? Within an hour of being home, we sat down, we talked, we figured everything out. We both had things we admitted. We both apologized for the way we acted. Fantastic. Fantastic. Sarah and I are back in sync, so we're acting as one again. So everything's great. Look, I got a smile on my face. Everything, the sun came out. Uh, we have a bright afternoon. All right, so I ended up getting two more pages done. I'm wearing one of my new shirts. I feel super fly. We're gonna go grab some barbecue food before the show tonight. Or, yeah, it's a show, it's a show. My lady's looking super fly. Shit, yeah. We're back on awesome terms. Give me a high five for awesomeness. Yeah, we're fucking rolling. Or we're rolling. So uh, yeah, dinner time. We're gonna get some barbecue and then hanging out with friends and some live music. Should be a fan call. <laughs> Should be a fantastic night. I owe Sarah a nice dinner, so I'm gonna leave this here. Birthday? See, he's getting the. What's your name? Camera. Mary Pat. I'm sorry. What's I your name? Mary Pat. But Mary I go by MP. MP. Well, happy birthday, MP. Thank you very much. Awesome. That'll definitely go on the vlog. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you. It's late. We're back home at Sanctuary. Tully was really good. His band sounded really good tonight. Nice work, fellas. Uh, we had a really nice night out. Sarah and I had a really nice night. She's currently sleeping on the couch. We're catching up on season two of Rick and Morty. So, you know, solid Friday night. Um, yeah, I think this is where I'm gonna call it a night. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for giving this video a thumbs up. Um, and remember, let's talk more rock. Rock on. Catch your cool cats tomorrow.